Hello everyone, Dane and Biggie here. He's come to say hello, he's come to help out. You might like this, Biggs, because we've got a box here. We have been sent in the post, Biggie, uh, My Chronicle Book Box. So uh, you can follow them on social media, at My Chronicle Book Box. Science fiction and fantasy, and they also have, uh, where is it, Crime and Mystery. So this is the Crime and Mystery Box, uh, which is a good fit for me. So they reached out to me via email and asked me if I'd be interested in doing an unboxing. And I thought, well, I know somebody who really likes boxes. Um, and I know somebody who really likes crime and mystery books. So it seemed like a good fit, didn't it, Biggie? Yes, so we thought we'd uh, accept them on their offer. I will link below to more information if you want to get a box of your own. And um, let's, let's have a look. I haven't opened it yet, so I don't know what we got. In fact, you can have the first look. And Biggie as well, what we got. Okay, let's have a look. Let's start investigating. Should we start investigating? Hi, Dane. Thanks so much for agreeing to review our monthly crime book box. Enjoy with our best wishes, Louise. We've got this nice little pattern there. Oh, okay. So it's, it's sealed. We've got this, like, uh, tissue paper. So we don't do that. There we go. Oh, Biggie. Oh, Biggie, what we got? So, uh, oh, we've got a letter here. July theme, the London commute. A very warm welcome to the ju bleh, a very warm welcome to the July monthly My Chronicle book box. Uh, there are spoilers ahead, so it's up to you if you read this before you unpack. Let's read it after we unpack, then, shall we? So let's have a look. What's this? The London commute. Five things I'd like my readers to know: an exclusive interview with Louise Candlish. Cool. Oh, that's really cool. So I've just flicked at the back. I'm not going to read the full thing out, but uh, dear reader, number one, I always wanted to set a book on a boat. One of my favourite books is Death on the Nile. And ever since I started writing, I've wanted to set a book on a boat. We all know how much I like Death on the Nile. We have this. Oh, Baker Street, 221B. Oh, that's really nice. That's just like a little print. Biggie, you're really liking this box, aren't you? What's your favourite bit so far? We've got this. What's this? Looks like a big old bookmark. Baker Street. Again, we have 221B. It's where Sherlock Holmes lived, Biggie. Yes, I know. Okay, we've got lots of these packing things. We've got lots of these, you know, we don't want those. I could pop it, but we don't want to scare the cat, do we? We don't want to scare you. All right, what's this? Ooh, hello. This is a bamboo travel mug. Eco-friendly mug to use again and again. I do have a reusable mug, but it's not a very good one. And um, as I'm going out a bit more now, I mean, I don't know, I get it because it's for like for the commute and stuff, isn't it? Uh, there is a little coffee shop just down the road, actually. You've been really, because uh, I've been helping out Wickham Art Centre on their social media. And they've been really quite supportive of us on Instagram. So I keep meaning to go in. So maybe I can go in and, and try this. Oh, here we go. It's got a nice little thing there to, uh, you know, stop you from burning your fingers. It's got this sealy bit up at the top as well. Oh, so you can put straw in it, I see. Or you can seal it up, I guess, to keep the heat in. Very nice. Do you approve, cat? It's good, isn't it? I know. Yes. I like it too. Right, what else have we got? Okay, we've got lots of these little things. Lots of these little things I think you'll like, Biggie. And we've got this. Which appears to be the book. So let's have a little look. How do we get in? That's tied at the back here. Nice bit of string. I tell you who else likes a bit of string. Who likes a bit of string, Biggie? Do you like a bit of string? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Get the string. Get the string. You're going to get the string from up there. Yes. Fishing. Oh, I've caught a big one. I've caught a big one, reel it in. So, let's have a look at the book. My Chronicle Book Box. Are you going to come and join me, Biggie? You're welcome to, if you would like to. Come and have a little look with me. So, what have we got? Louise Candlish, I've heard the name. Uh, the Other Passenger, oh, signed by the author as well. Uh, we've got a quote from AJ Finn. I've not read any of his work. Oh, I like that actually. That's really nice. That's clever how they've done that. Because, um, you know, I don't really like book plates and stuff. So that's actually printed onto the book and she's signed on it. Um, which I think is very cool. Uh, oh, 
I think I might read this next. I'm quite excited. Um, I mean, it's, I don't know about the cover. It's sort of fairly generic. Uh, this will be what she was talking about here then. Um, oh, there's a conflict between Gen X and Millennials. Oh, there's a lot of uh, music in it apparently. So Lana Del Rey's cover of the Sublime song Doing Time dropped when I was writing and it became Melia's theme song. She's inspired by Kipling. If you can meet with triumph and disaster and treat those two imposters just the same. Very cool. I'm quite excited about this. I probably will read this next. Um, I'm just, funnily enough, I'm just finishing off some non-fiction that Biggie's sitting on so I can't show you. Um, so, but it'll be good to go from non-fiction to go straight into picking up a fiction book. And that'll probably then ease me into my next Agatha Christie read. Okay, so I'm going to read this out. And then I suppose we'll close out the video. So, uh, blah, blah, blah. I'm thrilled to be presenting you with a signed first edition of The Other Passenger by Louise Candlish. Louise's first novel, Our House, was awarded Crime and Thriller Book of the Year 2019 at the British Book Awards. And she has gone from strength to strength. Louise Candlish's favourite description of her brand of crime novel is domestic noir. The other passenger is full of psychological suspense, elegantly written, and a wonderful, oh, and a wonderfully unpredictable. <laughs> the main theme, the London commute, comes from the daily river bus trip two of the main characters take together to work. Yeah, which is um, the boat itself. What is essential on the daily commute, or indeed when travelling at any time, a travel mug, of course. Jamie, from whose point of view the novel is written, is a barista, which made this the perfect gift to complement this book. Nice. Designed by Rex London's in-house graphic designers and made from bamboo fibre, this mug is both stylish and eco-friendly. The bamboo lid is spill-proof, ideal for when you're on the move. Due to the size of the cup, we have used our larger size boxes this month. There is more void packaging than usual, but it is all recycled, recyclable and biodegradable. We care about our environmental impact and try to minimise plastic in our boxes. Wait, this is biodegradable? Oh yeah, green light bio. In celebration of London, our capital city, and its greatest detective, I've included the beautiful Sherlock Holmes art print and supersized bookmark for you. No trip to London by a crime fiction fan would be complete without a visit to the iconic 221B Baker Street. The designs were created by Nazeel at Ghost Office Prints after her own trip to Baker Street, and I just love the colour palette she has chosen. The art print is printed on high-grade pulp paper to show it off at its best. I hope you enjoy this reading gift box, and I look forward to hearing your thoughts and seeing your photos. Be sure to tag us, uh, hashtag MyChronicleBookBox, at MyChronicleBB on Twitter, and my, at MyChronicleBookBox on Instagram and Facebook, so I can find them. Take care, stay safe, and happy reading. Louise. P.S. If you haven't seen it yet, August book theme is Detective Stories. More details are on the website. And that's MyChronicleBookBox.com. So yeah, very cool. Stoked to get to these, and uh, yeah, keep your eyes peeled for a review coming soon. Thank you to My Chronicle Book Box for sending it. So anyway, that's all I've got for you today. As always, thanks a lot for watching. Don't forget to let me know in the comments, I guess, if you've read this book or uh, let me know if you're going to be getting this book box. Hit that like button if you've enjoyed this video. Hit subscribe for more and I'll see you soon for another bookish video. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.